Showforge is a revolutionary new approach for powerful and efficient creation of synchronized animatronic lighting and other shows for applications such as museums, attractions, and interactive displays. Audio as well as lighting, output, and logic cues are placed within tracks on a timeline. While this concept is not new to show programming, Showforge's approach is innovative by offering two different modes or approaches of programming with instant swapping between modes. The recording and playback process has also been automated to reduce the steps required for programming. Showforge also uses graphical interfaces, combined with clean and simple organization for quickly configuring inputs, outputs, and timelines. With a Wiggle Pro Commander and other Wiggle devices connected, timelines can be viewed live with Wiggle devices locked in synchronization to all outputs and audio playback from the timeline. Let's take a quick look at the process and features. Once the ShowForge software is downloaded, installed on a macOS computer, and a Wiggle Pro Commander is connected per the Quick Start Guide, the software can be quickly configured for an animation show. The Settings tab is where global project settings are configured, such as keyboard shortcuts and selection of the connected Wiggle device network. Under the Shows tab, shows can be named. Projects can also contain multiple shows. The Outputs tab is where the connected Wiggle hardware devices are added to the project. Once the connected Wiggle device is selected and configured, ShowForge offers a unique visual reference for the available output and input ports specific to the device model. Available digital, analog, and DMX outputs can be added individually or in multiples and labeled. Showforge allows for a large number of different input devices to be connected for programming, such as joysticks, keyboards, keypads, mice, and lightboards. These connected device inputs are added under the Inputs tab. Once the preferred input devices are listed and selected, Showforge offers a helpful and intuitive visual interface for adding and configuring them. Triggering any button, slider, or joystick direction will immediately register live in the status window, allowing them to be quickly captured and added to the project. Artnet devices may also be added across many universes and as a range of channels. Once project settings are configured, audio and data output tracks are easily added to a show via icon-based buttons on the timeline. Audio files can be imported into the project and immediately placed onto audio tracks. Each audio track can be assigned to any of the available audio outputs of the target Pro Commander. Showforge uses a simple set of transport buttons to play, stop, and jump forward or backward on the timeline. The spacebar also provides play and stop functions for more efficient programming. Clean organization is also a key point to Showforge. Data output tracks are housed within output groups on the timeline as well as displayed in the Layout tab. All groups are also displayed in the Groups pane above the timeline. Track attributes such as inputs and output mapping assignments can be quickly changed in the Properties pane. Artnet devices can also be assigned across many universes for capturing and editing in a simplified form. Another Showforge key feature is the speed and efficiency at which outputs can be recorded and reviewed. Record and playback ranges can be toggled on and allow individual adjustment for the duration of each range in several ways by either dragging the envelope markers above the timeline, typing values in the range field, or using the right-click menu shortcuts. Combining these ranges with auto-looping streamlines the programming process by reducing the number of steps required for recording and reviewing outputs. Several different track mode options are available for automating the recording and playback process. These can be accessed directly on the group or track header or at a global group level within the group's pane. Tasks such as programming and reviewing animatronic mouth synchronizations are made easier in Showforge thanks to a speed control slider. Speeds can be adjusted on a scale from one tenth to two times real speed for both playback and recording. Envelope editing tools are also provided offering features such as cut, copy, paste, split, and slide in addition to tools for drawing and editing waveforms. A point editing mode allows for tweaking and optimizing of waveforms at an inter-envelope point level. Another unique feature to Showforge are the live and edit modes offering two different approaches to programming. So far we have shown the edit mode process which is timeline based. The live mode offers a more heads-up virtual programming console approach to the show programming process. In this mode, mapped outputs and inputs are shown as graphic panes, with the ability to quickly change input and programming mode attributes. This allows programming technicians to focus on the input device mapping while operating an attached animatronic character or other show equipment or effect for the programming process. Switching back to the edit mode is needed to adjust individual tracks in a timeline view. Exporting a completed project is also streamlined in Showforge. Project export settings are saved as a profile containing all attributes of the show or shows. 
Advanced logic coding can be auto-generated or custom edited as needed. Once the project export settings have been configured, the show files can be easily exported to a local folder on your computer, directly to the connected Wiggle device, or both, offering a more efficient one-click approach to show file deployment to multiple locations. Throughout this process, we created a simple show containing several digital outputs for an animatronic character combined with a single DMX light function, all synchronized to a short audio file. The show file is configured to auto start upon power up of the Wiggle Pro Commander, which is logic auto generated during our export process. For additional information and a quick start guide, please visit wigglecontrols.com.